Hi, I'm Maria Duenas Jacobs. I'm going to show you my very simple and sort of dummy proof everyday makeup routine. In the morning, I like to start off with a little bit of lip balm. And usually I have my three daughters next to me pulling my leg and wanting something. So I love this one because it's pink, so it kind of feels like it's real makeup and they get very excited. Next, my face is definitely thirsty in the morning and really needs moisturizer. And this is my favorite. It's Nutritious Pomegranate Moisturizer. I love it because it smells really nice, but it's not super fragrant, it's just enough, so it feels really luxurious, and I'm really not shy when it comes to moisturizer. My face just drinks it. So what I love to do is actually take my favorite tinted moisturizer, I add a little bit more of the cream, I mix them in together, and this really helps my face become a little bit more porcelain-like, and if there's any like patchiness, I feel like it evens things out for me, and it's the first step of feeling like I'm actually getting ready for my day and wearing a little bit of makeup, but it still feels a bit effortless and like the no makeup makeup look. The next thing I love to do is use Double Wear Waterproof Concealer. This is pretty amazing because you can actually put it on and it stays all day. So I just take a little bit and I dab it in. And I love using my fingers for everything. I actually don't like using brushes. It's just something that's like particular to me. The next thing I love that I feel makes a huge impact on my face is the three-in-one brow multitasker. So it actually has three pieces and I'll get to how it has three pieces because it doesn't really look that way, does it? Um, so this tip I love because it's super easy to come on and I actually start from the top here and I'm really into like a decisive brow, something that feels more like a statement. And you see like this eyebrow, for example, really needs a little bit of help, so this is exactly where I use this part. And I can actually brush it, so I go between them sometimes and I brush and I add and this is really fun for me just because it feels like I'm painting. And this is another little thing that I use on my daughters because they think it's makeup, but I pretend I'm doing their mascara. And then, this is the hidden secret that I wanted to share with you guys. There's a hidden powder. How cool is that? And then next is the Sumptuous Mascara. I really love mascara because I don't often use any eyeshadows or much things on my eyes. So this is the opportunity to really like use a mascara that I add liberally, and I try to always start from the bottom of my lashes so that it gives an effect of an eyeliner. But mascara makes such a big difference, it really makes you feel awake. And like now I feel like I'm wearing makeup, which is pretty great. This is Pure Color Desire Stagger, and I love the deep red, but the way that I actually like to use it is more dabbing it. So I don't fully commit to it actually, I just use my finger to blend it in. And then with what I have on my finger, I like to dab it on my cheekbones. And that's it. The last thing I use when I'm trying to do a little bit more of a dramatic eye is a little black eyeliner. I love this eyeliner because I'm not the best at it and it makes me feel like it's helping me. Um, it has this fine tip or it has this more square tip. I tend to like the one that's a little bit more fine because I think it gives me a little bit more control. And once I'm done with my eyeliner, I like to use mascara again, just in case I moved anything around and it needs a little bit more of a plump. And that's it. But I think I need maybe something else to wear, some more jewelry, and something special for my hair. 